Good morning, good morning. Welcome to another video. My name is Alana. If this is your first time on this channel, thanks for joining me today. So today I'm going to be painting a mural in Starkville, Mississippi. Also try not to trip myself on these on these curbs. So I woke up at 6.30 this morning, got ready to paint on my way to the mural site and I get a text that says we cannot paint what we prepared for. So I was going to paint a big wall with donuts so uh, it's dapper donuts or whatever right so we can't paint that because we are in a historic district and that counts as signage the only signage that we can have is um something that is not related to the donuts any products that will be sold inside of dapper donuts cannot be displayed or painted on the wall so now i am trying to figure out what to paint so i'm walking around trying to see what everyone else has done so yeah that's what's going on right now I'm also brainstorming so that's why I'm walking around we thought about like having words like yum and all kind of things like that but I'm not sure uh, how the owner, if the owner would like that the owner is also my friend so the my thoughts off rip she wouldn't like it because I've suggested it before and she just doesn't like that that style so now I'm just walking around brainstorming I'm actually gonna call from her now so I I'm gonna go answer that real quick and I'll be right back all right so I just got off the phone it's not happy but we right now we're thinking about some uh, words or whatever not like I think I already said this in the last clip so forgive me if I'm just recapping but she was upset and I'm also trying not to get hit by the cars as I cross the street hurry up but we're thinking about some words about yummy, they're like yummy, delicious, things like that. Kind of not like our first thought. You know how you come up with your first idea, like you're really hooked on it. And then you have to come up with another one and it's just not as good. So. Okay, I'm looking at this one. A lot of them have like characters as you can see. Like this has like a pig and a crown, which is very cool and unique. But. Maybe we can do something like this. But with the building that I have, I'll go back and show you. There's a lot of windows that are gonna break up the, the, uh, the design. So that's one reason why donuts were good. So we can break it up. Cause our original thought before that was to have like Homer Simpson eating donuts. Um, so we'll see. But I really like this design. I really like the colors. I like the, I guess that's a pig. And then, uh, um, some type of angel shooting shooting the pig. I'm not sure what they sell in there or if it even has anything to do with their business, but it's really cute. I wish I could like talk to y'all directly. Do y'all have any ideas of, you know, murals that we can paint here on the buildings? And you know, like I kind of had um, the color palette, the cans that I bought, they fit to go with donuts. So that's another kind of thing that we have to work through something that you know works well with those colors so we don't have to go buy brand new paint because some you know if you do paint or don't some of those cans can cost you know six six dollars to eight dollars just depending on what you buy so I have some Montana black and Montana gold in there and the Montana gold specifically costs you might as well say nine bucks with, you know, with change and tax. And then the Montana Black, it's like around six bucks. But you know, you can get, while well, I'm just talking about spray paint and all that stuff, for Montana, the white is the cheapest, but it also kind of gives you, it's just as good. The colors are just as vibrant. The paint comes out just as smooth. So if you're like trying to do um, painting with spray cans on a budget, you could use those as well. So I'm walking and I don't see any more this way. I think that was that was our best bet, those two that I just saw. I see something over here, so I'm gonna go walk and see that and let's see what we can see there. So that was just a trailer. That that, that is their business. Kinda have like a candy cane. I think they sell like um you know snowballs, uh, like icy type deal. So they have like a candy cane or maybe smoothies like 
get your groove on. So, I mean, that's that. It's a trailer. Let's see. I'm going to go back to the first wall where I got the call. I'm going to look at that some more in detail. I started to walk away because I had to go talk to our our um, business consultant who was telling me the news about these things. So, I'm going to go back and look at that wall and see. So, you also can see what I mean. But they just have like characters doing doing their own thing. But let's see what we can come up with. Oh, you can go ahead. <laughs> okay. Oh, they even painted the curb to match the mural. I get it. Here's another wall. You got a cute little puppy down here. It looks really cool, really cute and unique. So I was thinking maybe what if we had like something that complements these two because they're in the same area. We kind of make our own character, but I'm wondering, I don't know how they strict are strict. They are about like the whole um, donut thing, but I was trying to see maybe we can come up with a character that kind of looks like a donut, reminds you of a donut. And Mark, our consultant, he's he's saying when I say consultant, our business consultant, um, he is saying you know it's better to ask for forgiveness than permission. But the thing with that is. If we do something that we can't or are not supposed to do, we'll just end up having to repaint and I have to come back. And I've already been paid partially, so you know I kind of just want to do right by my. She is my friend, but you know I want to do right do right by my friend and the client, and just not have to do all that, not have to waste a lot of time and just get it right the first time. So we're not just you know doing all kind of stuff willy nilly, you know, just kind of have some structure to it. But I think a, a nice cool donut design but donut man or something like that would be cool but I'm gonna have to go back to my iPad and see what I come up with but I think I'm gonna just wrap that up as a vlog talk this as a lesson learned get all your um the things you need to know if you're painting in a in a uh, historic district each district comes with their own set of rules uh, if you're in, gonna be painting murals make sure you find that out and uh yeah I'll see y'all next vlog be blessed, stay blessed, and be a blessing. Love. I found one more mural. Uh, I'm gonna show it to y'all. It's just like a little mini mural. But the cool thing is, if you look from this vantage point, you're driving on the street, this wall right here looks like it's attached to the building that I'm gonna be painting on. Now, I don't know necessarily know if I want to do something that complements this or that has some florals on it, but it is a cool idea. Um, the mural, the, the background is very dark, but the painting itself is very dark as well. So maybe I could bring those complements. I'll probably go with the lighter color just because, you know, that's like I said, uh, my palette is already like donut themed. So, and we have this white wall to paint on. So let me see, let me see. Here's this, I'll give y'all a closer look so you can see, but it has like the floral in it, which is very nice, very nice job. I wonder how long it took them. Bloom where you are planted, that's very nice. So maybe something like this. So like I said, it looks like once you see um yeah from the point vantage point behind me or perspective behind me this wall looks like it's a part of this building but on the opposite wall this um it's blue it's navy blue it's that same navy blue that's that's right here so that's cool um in a design aspect but here i don't know you have to come back to another vlog to see i know i said i was gonna wrap it up but i just saw that and i thought that was really cool how they had the buildings placed Excuse my gum. I know it's probably irritating the hell out of somebody on the other side of this camera, but uh, I needed I needed it to calm my nerves. You know. Anyways, but 
you have this wall here are the windows i was telling you this it's going to be kind of tough because whatever we do the painting is going to be broken up by these windows right so that's the donuts were perfect because it's kind of choppy we, like i said we were going to do homer and the homer would have been really choppy to have them big so maybe we come up with like some donut man or something of that nature i don't know you got to come back to another vlog to see um but thank y'all for watching thank y'all for supporting be blessed stay blessed and get blessed love